Packs Pack here at com, where we open some cards. Woo! Welcome back to another WaxPackHero.com box break. We're here in mid-March. It's another week, so it's another Topps release. This week's release is 2018 Gypsy Queen. And um, the retail the retail blasters hit. It looks like a day early here in my town. So I went ahead and picked one up so that we can um, bust it open and see what we end up with. Gypsy Queen is one of those products that kind of it has a vintage feel to it. Um, it's one of those that some people love, some people can do without. Um, you, you've got about a 300 base card set with a few short prints on there and, and a bunch of different variations. Um, there are some autographs in the product, um, but really the, the fun things to chase are the different variations um, with Gypsy Queen. Um, the retail blaster boxes this year contain seven regular packs with, I believe, five cards per pack. Um, or six cards per pack, and there's one bonus pack that has five cards uh, with a special retail um, parallel or color to it. And so we'll see what we end up with. There, there are your um, potential options to get some um, autos. There's also some potential to get some relics, um, but we'll see what we end up with. Here right on top is the special five card exclusive parallel pack. Um, We'll go ahead, we'll save that one for last actually. We'll save the parallels there for last and we'll go with um, these other packs first. So again, this is 2018 uh, Gypsy Queen Retail Blaster Box. Um, we'll see what we get. This is my first look at any of these cards this year. Um, so this is what the front looks like. There, It's kind of a, again, like it has been in the past, kind of a, a painted feel. That's the back. So um, that's the front, that's the back. So we've got Enciarte, Lorenzo Kane, Matt Carpenter, Felix Hernandez, and right here we've got a variation already with the missing team name. Um, so that's one of the, the variations there. If you see, typically you've got your team name. This, uh, the Felix Hernandez is missing the Mariners uh, team name on there. So we've already got one variation here in the first pack. Adrian Beltre and David Peralta. All right, so one pack in, one variation. That's off to a good start. These are pretty neat looking, pretty neat looking cards. We got uh, Garrett Richards, Carlos Correa. That's a card for the PC. Uh, Steven Souza, and here is an insert, uh, King of Swords. These kind of have a feel of a playing card here, or a tarot card actually. Tarot of the Diamonds, it says. So that is one of the inserts this year. It's a Bryce Harper card. Garrett Cole and Melky Cabrera. There are just Jackie Robinson tribute variations this year. Um, a variety of different things to look for. Uh, Anibal Sanchez. Clint Frazier rookie for all you Yankees fans out there. Ichiro, still getting cards. Kevin Pillar, and this is another variation, the Gypsy Queen swap. So the typical one has the GQ. The swap has kind of a head shot or a portrait shot um, of, a, of a woman down here in the corner. So that's another variation, a Kevin Pillar variation. Aaron Nola and Joey Gallo. So, so far we're in uh, three packs in, and we've already got a couple variations. Looking for some of my cubby favorites or see if we can get an auto or a relic and really get lucky with our single blaster. But we've got a Miguel Cabrera, Rick Porcello, J.A. Happ, Andrelton Simmons, Brandon Belt, and Brian Dozier. I haven't been checking. The, the, the kind of regular short printed cards are card number... Um, 301 to 320 maybe they're they're over 300 I know that it's one of the things I don't really like about these this year that number down here that card number is really small and that is not going to be fun to do a lot of sorting um, but I was just going to check there's also a bazooka back variation which should be um, pretty easy to identify if we get any of those from what I can see and these all look like standard not not short printed they're all under card number 300 
But I thought I'd take a quick glance, quick glance through there. But yeah, that small little number back there is going to make sorting a nightmare for anybody opening these in, in quantity. I can't imagine some of the multi-case breakers and the time it's going to take to sort those. Keon Broxton, Francisco Mejia, Matt Harvey, Gregory Polanco, Alcides Escobar, and Shea Otani, another Otani rookie. I got my first Otani rookie last week in the opening day, and here we've got an Otani rookie in Gypsy Queen. Unfortunately, Otani's not been doing all that well um, through spring training so far, so some of the uh, lusters are wearing off a little bit uh, on him so far. Um, but it is an Otani. There's probably still a little bit of value to, to be had there. Um, we'll see. We'll see how things shake out with Mr. Otani. Zach Cozart, Sean Manaya, Vincent Velasquez, and we've got a fortune teller insert card of Trey Mancini. So Trey Mancini fortune teller insert. That's kind of a cool looking card there. We'll set that off to the side. Sandy Alcantara and AJ Pollock. We've got one more regular pack to go. And then our special pack of parallel cards. So Avacel Garcia, Alex Gordon, Logan Morrison, Ricky Henderson. So you've got a uh, retiree vet there, which is a short print, number 317. Luis Castillo and Mikey Matuk. I didn't notice any 42s, uh, Jackie Robinsons. I'm not sure how uh, how popular or how populous those are in the insertion ratios. I didn't get a chance to look real closely at the uh, the pack odds. And finally, we'll go with our last pack here of the parallel, the retail parallel um, variations. And uh, we start with uh, James McCann, Travis Darno, Alex Colome. Elvis Andrews, and Chris Archer. The interesting thing is these look a lot like the missing black nameplate um, parallels that have been on there, but I can't imagine that there'd be an entire pack of those um, as part of the retail. I didn't think those were the, the, the standard retail. I thought those were a little harder to find, um, but I guess I'll be corrected. I guess if maybe I could have uh, read the pack odds a little bit a little bit better and, and knowing what I was going to actually be getting in these retails but that is what it looks like the the retail um, parallel is is kind of this faded this faded look as opposed to the full color look that's kind of gives you that contra the contrast between the two different uh, the two different versions so that is it that is what we've got for the 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 retail blaster of Gypsy Queen got it a little bit early we've got a standard short print we got a fortune teller Trey Mancini insert an Otani base rookie a few other rookies but a couple of the other variations we've got the Pilar uh, Gypsy Queen uh, logo swap and the other big variation is the uh, Felix Hernandez missing team name and so that was kind of a, a cool little retail break there. A couple nice inserts, a couple cards for the PC, some rookies, uh, and a couple variations. Um, didn't get any autos, didn't get any relics, but that's all right. You don't necessarily expect those out of a single blaster box. So there you have it, 2018 Topps Gypsy Queen. Uh, go find some today.